Hey, thanks for checking in on Bathtub Sir, and I'm currently in the tub with MoonQuest. Now, are you a fan of Terraria? I wouldn't be surprised, it's a great game with tons of content. Now, did you ever want to play Terraria in space? Well, you probably should have played Starbound, a game that came out a few years ago. But, aside from that, would you ever like to play a game which is a mix between Terraria and Starbound? Then maybe MoonQuest could be the game for you. So this game came out on the 14th of July 2018 and it's in early access. So this is like the earliest access it could ever be. It only came out like a day or two ago. Um, probably why there's no sort of background music on the main menu. There's not really a, a logo here. We've got at play MoonQuest. It seems even, even the menu screen at the start seems bare bones. So I don't know how much content is here. It's currently priced at £9.29 and there's no sale at the moment. It's developed by a studio called Wizard Mode and it is, as you may have guessed, a sort of pixel art, roguelike, get your materials together, build stuff sort of game. Uh, yeah, they're at official terms. So, I don't know how much content is here, but the game looks brilliant in terms of pixel art. And I always can appreciate some good some good pixel art. So, we will choose our character, I guess. Um, so we can be a human. Maybe suffering from internal parasites, gold or easy mode. Now, I think the general gist of this game is that we need to get these things called moonstones. I'm not 100% though. Can we change what kind of human we are? Oh, so it can be a male or a female. Or, or just different types of humans, because we are very different, each and every one of us. So unique. However, the moon man, look at that. <laughs> a strange denizen. He feels no emotion. He glows. Oh, God, I love the look of him. My God. It's like someone injected DNA into like a jelly baby. It came alive. I don't know if that's how science works. But then we have a... Uh, I mean, what are you? Like a ruptured vagina. A creature of the water. Gills. Water moon. No, it's an amphibian. Okay, you definitely look like something's prolapsed, but I'm not quite sure. Um, we're going to have to go for Moon Man. How could we not? I love the smile on his face. In a strange moonlit world, a being is summoned. Okay. He is tasked with a quest to bring light to a dying planet. His journey begins underground. Holy fuck. That's a big old snail. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I don't know how to jump. But we're hitting this huge snail. Get away, get away, get away. Wait, is that good or bad, this thing? Oh, you might be friendly. <laughs> How do I talk to you? Oh, shit, Solomon. Dude, I'm so sorry. We've been trying to crack your shell open like a pistachio. We have a great quest ahead, you and I. Okay, Solo. Seek the moonstones and power this, grand uh, this great machine. If you say so. So already there's more of a like direct story to this game. We haven't been completely thrust into a hostile world like Terraria and just told to build. We've been greeted by a huge alien snail. So what did he say? Get moonstones. A Solomon's borrow. Okay. I don't quite know what we do here. So space jumps. This Wazda, uh, Wazda and space bar. Okay. As always, I'm very sorry if you hear the click clacking of my keys. It does like a weird double jump. I think we're just bouncing the shell. Well, let's move along then. Go out this way. Knock you down. What have we got? So we've got... Is that a torch? No, it's a... Sh oh, shit. What was that? Oh, that wasn't some of Solomon's shit. Right, I think we're using... I mean, it doesn't say what item it is. This is like some sort of rake. And then was this a shovel? Okay, we need a pickaxe to break stone. So we're just going to bust our way out of here? Oh, it's a wooden door. No. <laughs> push open the doors. Very cool pixel style though. Looks awesome. And I love our, our moon man. I want to get out of here. But I mean there is building and everything. Um, you can build a little base for yourself. You can explore caves. Oh that's how we get out there. Beautiful. The books. We just broke the books. Okay. And that's our way out. A cave entrance. More like a cave exit right? Surely. We need to get out of the habit of hitting everything. Whoa, what the fuck? Are you bad? Tartan? Calm down, Tartan. What happened to your lips? Jesus Christ, did you try and get your, your lips injected and went terribly wrong? Oh, man. Well, you should always have the perfect duck face for any selfies. Tartan, he's got a... Wait, what is going on? It's a bit confusing. I need some sort of tutorial here, I think. Be gone, adventurer. If I can talk like that to me, Tartan, I'll turn you into tart. No, he don't even feel that. Oh, he does. Fuck off, Titan. Fuck off. Get away, get away, get away. 
Alright, that's a fight we might not be able to win. Um, in here we go. Cannot exit. Tortin is nearby. Oh, I thought his name was Tartan. He's dead! <laughs> we slayed Tortin. What a big sack. Oh, he disappeared just like that. Was it wise to brutally bludgeon Tortin to death there? I don't know. That's the sort of stuff that will haunt us at night, Moon Man. But I think we'll be okay. Oh, these are like travel, uh, fast travel stones. Okay. Can we breathe underwater? I mean, we're the Moon Man. That doesn't necessarily mean we can, but I feel like... Oh, no, there's an oxygen in the top left, so we can't. I thought maybe because he's like an alien race, maybe he can just breathe wherever he wants. So let's have a little look here. Our inventory, our tool kit. To craft a dig stick, we need two bits of wood. To craft a mallet, wood. To craft a, a mini pick, wood and what I presume is stone. To craft a torch, you need wood and some purple goo. Well, let's get out of here. This cave is uh, quite dangerous. Discovered hollow of the circle. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, it's snowing, I think. Oh, my God. What are these things? Oh, they're dead. One of them was definitely a spider. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, what's this door here? A door. Thank you, game. Very informative. Discovered the forbidden abode. So we're in someone's room that we're not meant to be, I assume. Oh, my God. There's a knight there. I don't think we could take out that knight. Not afraid to die, okay. Yeah, he... Oh, fucking hell. Moon Man, run. Save yourself. Cannot exit a knight is nearby. Fuck. We're dead. Unless we can cheat. Ooh. No, he can also get us here. I mean, we could maybe try and do it like this. Oh! Come on. I'd love to be able to take him out. I hate to say it, but one more hit and we are dead. The Moon Man, no more. But look at this fucker, he's swinging like crazy. Unless, can we break through here? No. It's kind of bullshit, I just can't run away. Oh, we can run away. <laughs> awesome. So it seems the night wasn't that nearby. Still doesn't help the fact we're very close to death. What is this? A sloth with a long neck. It's a horse, are you sure that's a horse? That's the uh, the quick travel. I have no idea what's going on. I think we should refrain from killing stuff for a while. Oh, can we break this stuff? We can. We got oil, that's probably what we used to make the torches, right? It's actually not quite like Terraria uh, in any way. Terraria, Terraria. What's the, what's the verdict on that? How do you say that name game? Um, but yeah, it's not that similar at all. Way more story based and way more what the fuck am I doing? I suppose we should try and make some stuff. Discover the breeding and excavation. That doesn't sound good. Breeding could mean there's a lot of things in here. Oh, what is this? Eggs. How do we like our eggs on foreign planets? There we go. We like them harvest with no remorse. Let's hope we don't find the mother of these eggs. Um, let's try and craft something then. We only have wooden planks. Oh, let's find a tree then. I guess that's the first point of call. We'll venture outside again. But yeah, I think hopefully they uh, add a tutorial sort of immediately. What we've been told just to get the moonstones and that's it. I could do with like some just some very basic tutorial tips. I, I know I do understand the joy in finding stuff out as you go along, but I feel a bit like a, I'm in a heavy current heading downstream. Just like being sloshed about, not knowing where I'm going. What the fuck? Moon Man! Oh man, what a death. Killed by a tick, got bruised head. Fuck. Now, is it permadeath? It's not permadeath. Cool. We could go kill that knight then, maybe. I just want to find like a tree of some sort. It's hard to tell what you can stand on and what you can't. I think that's a tree up there. No, 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 let me through. Okay, I'm still not quite sure if I'm enjoying this or not, I've got to be honest. Maybe I should give it more of a chance. Uh, can we break that tree? No, we can't. It's Oh, maybe we can? I thought it was background. Now, is that breaking? We've got lumber. Brilliant. Uh, so you can make wooden planks with one bit of lumber. We don't want to do that. Oh, is that a cat person? There's a chest there as well. I mean, can I build up with these planks? 
I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. So that's going to be solid. Yeah, just like the way the building works would be nice to know. We got up there. Oh, we've done it somehow. Okay. I want to get in that chest if I can. Yes, what is this? An iron ingot? We'll take it. What was this? Gold ingot? Silver ingot? Yeah, I need that. And then this stuff. Okay. Now we break the tree. Nice, we're getting lumber. Oh, you get the indiv uh, individual squares of lumber. Brilliant. Okay, cool. Oh, no. I didn't want to fall down there. That's a bastard place to get back up to. But we can try and, and uh, craft in the safety of our own home now. This is our home, this hovel. Um, a mallet smashes rocks. Okay. Put you there. This was a broom, was it? Was it a broom? Why does it say the name of it? It's a weapon. Okay, so the broom's our weapon. We'll put it in our first slot. A dig stick. Oh, that's another weapon as well. I'm sure it's not just a shovel? Right. So we can make a dig stick if, this one, if the one we have breaks. So would the dig, the dig stick be better at getting through the soil? I think it only just... Oh, yeah, it does crack quite a bit. Fucking tell me to stop, hey? Bring it, cat boy. <laughs> what a weird enemy design. In fact, we'll just jump over you. What do the signs say? Wait, what the shit did I do? Discovered the clearing. I thought that was like health, uh, helpful directions. Didn't know it would take me to a strange place. This is a, a small horse. Okay, are you sure? Right. So, with the, the mallet we got, can we get some stone? Yeah, it looks like we can. Also, take that door as well. Jugs. Give me your sweet jugs. Oh, the sack speaks. <laughs> what are you doing, you big sack? Well, he's dead now. And this won't break anymore. Oh, because I'm using the shovel, not the mallet. There we go. So. Oh, it's sharp stone I need, not just uh, stone bricks, though. What is this? A table? Gimme. Oh, we've got lumber from it. Can we not ride these horses? Oh no, is that damage showing on him? On his backside, like the red spots? Come on horse, you've got to die now. It's got to be the weirdest design for a horse I've ever seen. Will it die? Maybe we get some sweet horse meat? Or I will feel a bit bad about eating this. I imagine the moon man don't give a fuck. I imagine that smile is just to hide a completely psychotic brain behind them eyes. <laughs> I mean, he just literally slaughtered a horse with a smile on his face the whole time. Now, oh shit. I guess we can heal. So that's done for. Don't know what we can replace it with. Let's try the stone wall. Okay, we've got a few. And then was that it for this area? Let's go back. Oh, we're at a market. Be careful out there. Thank you. Okay, that's a very oddly placed... Barricade, wall thing. How are you doing? Amy, craft heavy sword. Can we, how do we get this from you? Will you give it because we have, oh, because we have the uh, iron ingot? Hell yeah. Good shit, Amy. You're the man. May the moons be with you. And you. And you. What's up, dude? You got any quests or anything for me? Hamilton. You can craft coins. No, no, no. I think that's illegal. How do I get in here? Um, they're not going to kick off if I start breaking things, are they? Oh, it's a chest. You can walk past it. Okay. Can we steal it? A moonlight potion. Can we be drunk in glowing liquid illuminate? Should we drink it? What's the worst that could happen? Alright, bottoms up, moon man. No, don't punch with it. Illuminate. Oh, so now now we uh, we light wherever we step. That's kind of nice. A grindstone. No. A workbench. Right, okay. This is how we'd make a little house and stuff. Glad we found this town. A mechanical tool bench, craft wire, mechanism. It's a bit overwhelming. What have we got here? You're an armorer, are you? I think. Skull. Cool name. How about you? Point arc. So long. No, you're so long. How do we get out? I want to get back into the world now. Try our new thing. 
so as we can teleport like this. So we could just keep heading left. Look at that awesome sword. It fits your moon man. Oh, is that it? No, okay. Kinda wanna take on the knight now. Get out of the way, you don't speak to me like that, dude. Get out of the way again? What's wrong with you? Speak to me like that. Fuck. Okay, see you later. Oh, he's dead. We won. <laughs> we won. You lost, Knight. Take that. No one will ever remember you, but they'll always remember the name of Moon Man. Okay, now we got to make sure the village didn't see any of that. La, 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 la. We're just a Moon Man walking. Let's get out of here. Let's go back to... Phew, Star area, the forest, the west hollow of the circle. Why not? But yeah, the, the game doesn't quite grip me as firmly as Terraria and Starbound did in the past. Maybe because I just don't know what the fuck's going on in a bad way. There we go. It has got a cool style. I'm not sure of the substance yet. It feels clunky. I don't know, but I think this is just because it's so early access. Whoa! I mean, it has got some interesting sort of stuff like that. This looks like some sort of dungeon. Was it booby trapped? There's glass here. But I can say already, if it, if I was you, I would maybe hold off on this game until more is added. Like I said, it's like a day or two after release. So as long as the devs stick with it, that's obviously. I mean, really, I'd advise you not to buy it until it's out of early access. It's always a risk. Oh, there's spikes on the ground there. That's how the horse died. It's always a risk, and I'd hate for you to waste your money because of me. Um, so maybe hold off for a good while. Keep an eye on it. Keep it on your Steam wish list or something. Die, pig. <gasps> the pig killed us. Ended by a human. Are you fucking mad, game? That was no human. That was a pig head. And we, and we got a damaged neck. Oh, it's a very quick respawn, though. Right, let's kill this dude. Get vengeance on the piggy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm very good at uh, baby impressions and pigs. Is this our stuff? Take all. Oh, put the door back. Okay, fine. Pick that up again. No, we won't. Because I don't know how. Oh, you walk over it. But yeah, I mean, this video should hopefully be a good inkling of where the game could head. With a bit of more, like, nurture and love and stuff. What is this? A stash. We've got moss. Greystone. Greystone block. I mean, I haven't got into any of the building yet, but I feel like it would be a bit clunky. So how do we drop things? Like this? Like that, okay. There we go. We built a little tower. So your building's going to be very similar to Terraria, I think. Oh, there's another sign up there. Okay. But, I mean... I don't know what we're meant to do. We're meant to get some moonstones or whatever. I do love Moon Man. He could become a real meme if, the game, if this game took off. He's cool as hell. But yeah, I think I've got to suggest in good faith to hold on to your cash until this game really uh, gets going, you know? It's only just barely crawling at the moment. I'm sure if it's only just been released, there'll be updates sort of every day, you'd, you'd like to think. Um, a, a tutorial is needed. Just a bit of polish at the moment. But, I mean, it's one to watch, definitely. And if you enjoyed this episode of In The Tub With, please go ahead and leave a like. It helps me out a great deal, and I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more, we do In The Tub With every Monday. We also do Let's Plays every other day of the week, and we live stream twice a week. So there's plenty here for you. Please go ahead and subscribe. I can bring it all to you. If any questions you want to raise, have you played MoonQuest yet? How, what do you think of it? Does it seem like a cheap rip-off of Terraria or Starbound? Or do you think it has the potential to come into its own? Please let me know in the comments below, and I will make sure I get back to you. All right? See you!